Red or blue pill. Hi ho, Kermit the Frog here. Augmentation programs loaded. Topside assets ready. Hello and welcome, or welcome back to Trinity Red or Blue Pill. Hi ho, Kermit the Frog here. This is going to be something different. A quick, short article on something that I find very unusual. So, if you're new here, welcome. And if you're not, welcome back. I'm so glad that you're here. So, thank you for being here. It's absolutely free to watch it to the very end. And that helps me tremendously. And your comments mean a lot. And thank you for the gifts and the letters and the UPS and all your support. And I hope that you can read between the lines and some of the things that I put in here. I hope you enjoy. All right. Alien hammerhead flatworm named after pandemic. This was seven days ago. Hammerhead flatworms are often described outside their native range. The scientists have discovered an alien hammerhead flatworm species that looks a bit like a miniature king cobra or perhaps an itty bitty snake with a mustache. This researchers found the tiny creature hunting snails in France and Italy and they've named the invaders after the COVID-19 pandemic according to a new study. Hammerhead flatworms are among two newly described species found in countries that researchers believe are not part of their native range. So they were very likely introduced by humans. Scientists dubbed the first soil dwelling predator species Humberton covidium with Covidium being a reference to COVID-19 as an homage to the numerous casualties of the pandemic and because much of the 55 page study was written during lockdowns due to the pandemic. I hope this is not, I'm reading an article so the algorithm should not be hitting me hard on this. I'm reading a live science on Google and please know whatever I'm sharing and reading with you. Do your own research. You never know. I can't prove this PDF or anything about it. I'm just reading an article that I just was like, what is this? Due to this pandemic during the lockdowns, most of us were home with our laboratory closed. No field expeditions were possible. And the lead author, Jean-Lou Jacin, a professor at the Museum National de Historia Naturelle, National Museum of Natural History in Paris said in a statement, I convinced my colleagues to gather all the information we had about these flat worms, do the computer analysis, and finally write this very long paper. To summarize this article, it said that these are found in Asia and they are hammerhead flatworms and accidentally transported around the world by humans and soil and that these flatworms can reproduce asexually. So one hammerhead flatworm can give birth to offspring without a mate, making it easier for them to establish themselves as an invasive species. Organisms that cause ecological or economic damage to the environment. Hummerton covidium were discovered in two gardens in the Pyrenees at a Atlantiques, I'm not trying to say that, in southwest France, and a garden in Veneto in northern Italy. Although the species likely originated in Asia, reports indicate that the species may also be in Russia, China, Japan, according to the study. The research discovered the second species with the name Diver Sabapilium. I have no idea. Maya <laughs> I have no idea how to say that. Um, on Mayoet, a French island off the east coast of Africa in the Indian Ocean, and these species could have been introduced to the Mayoet from Madagascar. Studied the anatomy and the morphology of these flatworms and carried out genetic analysis to, nor to formally describe these new species. Divergulospelium meotatasis. You can laugh all you want. I'm laughing. I can't. I, I'm hooked on phonics. I don't know how to say this. I have a unique green-blue iridescence 
and the researchers determined that the species belonged to a hammerhead sister group, distinct from all of the hammerhead flatworms. This species could therefore be important to understanding the evolutionary history of hammerhead flatworms. New species measured about 1.2 inches, 3 centimeters long, and that's small for hammerhead flatworms, which can grow to be more than 15 inches or 40 centimeters long, and may explain why the new species have previously been overlooked by researchers according to the statement. Means were published February 1st. I will link this article below. The power of kindness. Please be kind. I hope someone's kind to you. Thank you again. I thought this was really weird and interesting. There's a lot that I want to say about this. As you know, I got to be careful. Huge thank you again for the UPS gift and letter and all your support buying me a cup of coffee or helping me through this really crazy time or just watching the video till the very end and liking or subscribing and commenting below. That really helps me so much. I am so extremely grateful and I have a lot more that I'm working on and getting out to you. Thank you again.